everybody welcome back this is Nilnar and we're once again in mortal shell so last uh, episode we've continued exploring around learning some good stuff uh, learning what not to do and learning some good areas to do um, I still wish there was a map in here there isn't um, it does have a few items and lore that we can work on and a couple things I really need to worry about is we got to get some more armor and looking at the visions of the guys in the temple back here there should be one right through here past this uh, bear now doing some research this is the first one you're supposed to take out first type boss um, and your your attack is you got to be more cautious than you would probably be in most games. Ooh, he hit hard. I didn't quite make it there that's what you have to do you have to really dodge his attacks more and it's not about hacking and slashing in this game so we're going to try it again here and see what we can do I've kept your flesh safe family so let's go get our stuff back and try this guy again I'm going to go right across. Oh, I didn't time that right. Okay. Oh, and that's what you don't do is you don't sit there and just beat on them. That's the hard part is not doing that. And you gotta marry use your Killed one more, but you got to get good at doing this battling because this is how you fight most things here is dodge their attacks, shield. And deal with your mana. Oh man, you can't let that status stamina go down at all. I try to use the shield and it didn't work. I'll get her. I did a little bit better that time. We will get her. Uh, one way or another, we're going to take this one out. I'm going to learn the dodging tactics of this game. I 
Yeah, yeah. Not an easy one, I have to say that. And part of it is the controls are not... I won't say responsive, they're just awkward. Wow. Oh, okay. Ouch, hit me in the backhand. Try this again. I try to hit the Wow. Oh man, that's the most I've gotten damage out of them. And this is so I can get my first upgrade. That's the bad thing. This is just to get the first upgrade. For sure, I don't have any upgrades until I get that. I'll double check here. I gotta get something in order to do upgrades, so I can't switch weapons, can I? Well, these are just sensing where they're at. So until I get the upgrade, I can't upgrade this weapon, so I have to take him out. Okay, let's uh, go do this guy one more time. I'm actually going to see if I can grab that chest, because there's an upgrade in that chest. If I can grab that, I might be able to use that to make this guy easier. I don't know if I can get it. I 
get him to come over here. Okay, we got it. Now let's go upgrade. That's all I wanted was the upgrade, but I still got to kill him. But supposedly this upgrade will make it easier from what I can read. So there we go. We got the first upgrade. Got to hold down the A button upgrade. There we go. How to use that? That's the question. Let's see. Press the hidden button, huh? So I don't know what that hidden button is, but we're going to go upstairs here real quick. And we want that. I don't know if that would help. I don't know. We might we might end up doing that. Not just stamina. I think we'll just stay with the frogs here. Or the rats, I should say. Go back down. We're going to try them now. We got to see how to use that still, of course. Does it say here? Doesn't say. I'll try it. That's all we can do is try. There's no upgrades that we've seen otherwise. I'm going to do that. Let me go back into this. What's this say? Abilities. Yeah, I discovered its name first, and I haven't been able to find its name. We may have to go hunting for that. Now, this is a long fight. We're going to have to... I say stay away from that one because he will uh, hit you hard. Okay. Stay back from him. We will do it.
Oh. Just like that. Just keep doing that. We got to keep that up. Oh, dang. So close. We did pretty good that time. I haven't figured out how to use the specialty weapon yet. Because that one's supposed to stagger pretty good. That in front of that one for the moment. Hit the wrong button there. There are glimpses, unlimited use equipment. Hmm. Interesting. I didn't realize I didn't have that one on uh, record there. Um, I had paused to wipe my hands off and didn't realize I had paused it, but I had them down a good halfway. I got trapped over in that corner there. I want to get my stuff back, but I got to get him. Okay. Now we'll fight him. Oh, man, right into him. That's the worst one to get hit by. Right into it.
I get my You get them down here, maybe. Can I get him down here and grab this? No, you got to kill him first. We gotta get through that little cave there, but we can't do that until this guy is dead. Uh... Oh, dang it. <sighs> Boy, is he rough. I'll try this again here. Okay, we gotta go. I don't have enough power, so I think I need to do some leveling up here with that to get the name of the mortal shell so I get better understanding of its abilities. I know that's the thing you're supposed to do. Um, can you do that? By coming out here and killing things and getting that tar. I thought I had more tar than that, but I guess I didn't. So I need to work on getting tar then. I also need to figure out where these keys are. To unlock those chests. So let's work on getting some skill up and then we'll go back. We realize now he's tough. And the only thing I can do is I gotta upgrade my shell. But you gotta learn its name. To do that, I gotta get 250 tar. And you get those by killing things. I gotta get better at attacking, too. That's the hard part. Oh. They can actually get caught in them too, huh? Okay, now I should be able to parry with that. That's good. Come out here. My stamina back. Okay. 
Okay, we've got a little bit more there, but no tar. So we're going to have to go around killing more things to get tar. And stop running into traps. Dang it. Hey, come on out. Hey, we're, we're getting more of the uh, special ability, which I still haven't figured out how to use. I'm going to go back up here, look around, see if I'm, I know there's a, another mushroom up here I need to get a bit while I'm here. There we go. Anything good back here? Oh, there's a chest I didn't never looted. Ah, you get the, the leer. Anything else? Nope, well, we already know what that takes us to, okay. I look around. I know this is a bigger guy, but we should be able to take these guys now. Oh, dang. I didn't realize. What's that do? Let's see. No, that's from tar. That's currency. We need to. Oh, let's see. I haven't been consuming that. Let's. Do I have enough tar now? Do I have to have something else too? Go back and talk to her and see if I have enough. Otherwise, I may have to get one other item, but I need to find out what the name is of this guy because that will, I think, increase our ability with them. Now we hold it down. There we go. Horus. Okay, now we understand who he is. That'd be nice. That might be nice too. Hey, we'll, we'll, we'll do whatever we can. There we go. Effigy of Horus. What's that?
Okay, don't know what that does yet. I think I have to use it when I'm not in my shell. Like when I get knocked out or something. So we'll put that up there in case I get knocked out at some point. I can try to use it. And then... I want to keep that one there. Don't need that in there right now. Uh, that is stamina regen. That's poison damage. I have fair doubt, but I'm assuming that's going to be bad. Uh, okay, so let's try this. Uh, it does uh, resolve. Okay, now we have a lot of resolve. Cool. Okay, let's see if this extra ability, maybe we can do something. We'll try it here. Can't hurt. I mean, what worst case is I die and start it back over. But I want to take him out. Oh, yeah, that works good. Oh, yes, I like that. Oh, that hurt, that hurt, that hurt. Oh, wow. Okay. One more try. I need to use that uh, stamina and then not get died. Because that, that's what it does. It loses all that when you die. And so let's see. This guy here, I think, gives it to us. Oh, maybe what was... Oh, we are probably out of it now. That gives a shell. That doesn't do it. Okay. Let's see, what's this one do? Okay, that summons that. So what's this one do if we get hit? I may just have to go around and be collecting a bunch of items here, but... Played a chance there, that's for sure. Hey. I 
I didn't have my hardener back up. Get out of there. I didn't, that that was terrible. Okay, let's keep this up. Back up. Lots of dancing, lots of dancing. Okay. Oh man. Oh, dang it. I thought I was far enough around. Patience, patience. Wait for my opening. Patience, patience. Halfway. That's where I normally get them. Maybe a little bit more, but... Patience. Patience, patience. Oh, dang it. I had them. I had them until then. Okay, well, we made some progress. We got some upgrades on the armor. I think I need to go around and just... Picking things up, not going into any of the boss areas. This is the first boss we have to do, and it's 
he has the most hit points. Um, not necessarily the hardest, but not the easiest. So, I think on the next episode, we'll look at seeing how well we can collect things. I'll do some more research to see what maybe I need to upgrade that... Eh, as far as I know, we don't need to upgrade anything else until we beat this boss, but we'll, we'll do some checking around with that. Um, otherwise, uh, I think everything else is for different weapons. Maybe I need to find a different weapon. Uh, this is for the Molten Spike. I've only had this one. Uh, the, I guess these are all for the Hollow Sword, so maybe I need to find the Molten Spike and some other stuff, but supposedly I should be able to do it at this point. And I think it's just a matter of me learning how to do it and getting upgrades, like the casting materials that I need. So with that, I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, give me a like button. If you're new to the channel, give me a subscribe. And we'll see you on the next one.